action. Now that uh, I took that fuck up off. So we're back, kinda. We kind of started over. recording. We kind of started recording this episode. We're already, already smoking the joints. Yeah, we're already smoking the joints. We're almost to the ash density, but we do have some scores from other stuff. So, as we're doing this, maybe Derek can go over it again. Okay, we are doing a commercial pack of rolling papers. So this is a promotion pack of papers for a business. It's Omni Music record tapes and paraphernalia. Okay, so keep in mind this is an older pack, came from a vintage lot of papers. So my guess is this is from late 70s, early 80s. But um, one thing that made us laugh our asses off is this totally. Omni Music, totally. records, tapes, and paraphernalia. Keep that in mind. Okay, then you open the cover and it says music supplies, which you expect. Omni Music. And water beds. Water beds. What the fuck? Now, when it says, and paraphernalia, I'm thinking water bombs. Gary's thinking water bombs. Maybe it's a misprint? Um, if that's the case, that's a fail. If it's not the case, it should be paraphernalia plus. plus. Which would just leave it open to everything else. Um, now, that being said, this is what it gives us for contact information right here. 710 East Durant. Where's that? 425-8768. Where's that? So, doesn't say what city, what state, what country. N nothing. Who knows? <coughs> Fail. Fail on what it's meant to do, which is advertise. Color? Company. Color printing on the back. Nothing written on it. But full color. But color. So yeah. We'll so, bring this down real quick. Yeah, we gave it a four. We gave it a four. Because it's just a complete waste of yeah. space and time. And it gives mixed messages and it's now, just useless. The scent of the paper. Which we found had a very uh, kind of vanilla hint to it. Yeah. A vanilla note. Not not very, but just a, a, a slight hint of vanilla, which yeah. could have been packaging. Like maybe it was packaged in with some scented shit way back when, right. somewhere along the way before Derek got it. But the point is, is we judge what's here That's and right. now. All right. It has a vanilla scent. It's supposed to be so scentry. As like, far as we know. Well, yeah, it doesn't say. It doesn't say on the pack. So. Because we don't even know how many leaves are in the pack. No. It says so nothing. So we nothing. Just, we're giving it an eight. Yeah, which it should get less, but whatever. Uh, we rolled them. They were fucking perfect rolls. As you can tell, I've already lost my ash, which is right there, which loses ash density. Oh, yeah, the ash density on this is horrible. Yeah, we've had flaking. Okay, we've been, uh, all the, kinds yeah, of shit. Roll was a perfect 10. It was super easy because it's, a, again, a wider paper. It's huge. So it's the length of a zigzag or a Rizla, a standard 100 paper in a pack. Exporting, whatever. But double this way. Double width. It's like two papers. So away. it makes it real easy to roll. However, it also makes it very heavy paper pulp taste when yes. you're smoking it. Right here. So, anyways, uh, roll was 10. Burn, I mean, gum is 10. because it was Yeah, lick it, it and stick it, no problem. For an older paper, that's great. That's great. Yeah. I did have to unroll the... The, the glue part on my paper because it's that old and you know it age, curled yeah you know, with age comes wrinkles but <laughs> but yeah zing but yeah so uh, it's still it got a 10 because yeah. it's sticking perfectly yeah and uh, now we are doing burn which uh, my burn's been pretty consistent all the way through but his hasn't I had in the previous attempt to start this video which dumbass had the mic turned off, our new mic, because, you know, I'm not used to it. It's always on on that stupid fucking webcam thing. But uh, we had a new mic. <laughs> we spent it, we managed to scrape together all our newies and shit out of the cars, between the car seats and shit and under them. And Quarters, nickels, dives. Whatever yeah. it was, yeah, we got it. But we got a new mic, so hopefully this sounds better. Uh, but yeah, forgot what I was saying, because the new mic is exciting. Anyways. 
Burn. I had some issues. That's what we were doing. I had a run. It ran up the one side pretty good. I had to correct it. Since then, it's been okay. So, you know, I'm deducting two off the burn for uh, for that big run that it had. And it wasn't a roll job because, like I say, it's been perfect ever since. So, burn. You good with an eight? I'm good with an eight. Now we've got Roach. Eight. Wait a minute. Roach is out. Yeah, Roach is out. I already yeah. took that out. Yeah. Because I knew it was out because it's just a um, the lumber factory. Quantity cost, we had to give it a five because, again, I bought it in a bulk lot of a bunch of vintage papers and paid a bulk price for it all. So, and couldn't tell you what it worked out to for the book. That's why we want to change that category. Yeah. Need your help. Give us a different category or, or give us a, yeah, something else that we can change the quantity yeah. cost category to something else because we just kind of can't come up with anything you know because we're fucking because we're dumb well and i'm even dumber than dumb but yeah um okay so ash density boom oh, it's losing some it's there. been a straight up fail like it's flaking like mad the ash just drops off of it here i got an ash that's just about ready for ash density so it's gonna be a laugh well i've already had one fucking fall right off okay I'm, I'm flaking everywhere. Light shake. Okay, lots of flakes, but the ash is still there. I didn't even get a shake. Yeah. Medium shake. Alright, still there. Happy metal concert. There it goes. So. Well, you've got a run up the one side. Oh, so I do kind have of a run. It's affecting it. I know, I was going to mention something, but. Oh, and look, here's a flake from it. Yeah, uh, it's just fucking flaking everywhere. I'm giving it a straight up fail on ash density. I'm, I'm at like a two. Yeah, I was gonna say, I was gonna say two or three. So, <laughs> but with the width of the paper, that's gonna happen. <coughs> with any paper that's a two width, you're gonna have a lot of flaking <laughs> and hacking. And hacking. Yeah. Which is so what I'm doing. doing. I just hit the microphone. I hope that didn't blow your eardrums. Yeah, sorry guys, we're kind of getting used to placement. We may have to place that a little farther away. We may have to hang it from the ceiling. Yeah, we may have to just keep Derek's hands tied behind his back or something. That sounds fun. <laughs> uh, so, taste. The new category. Awful. The, the new category that replaced. Yeah, it does not taste good. I'll tell you that right now. And I'm so fucking happy that we replaced it. We're not doing a snipness thing anymore. That fucking... Yeah, so... Bye -bye. Taste. Straight up taste. Straight if up I'm taste. giving it, like, just raw blast honesty, I'm at, like, a three. Yeah, I was actually at a two because I can so really, really taste that paper. Yeah, it's it's a heavy, heavy taste. And it doesn't taste good. And it's making me hack. It's harsh. And it's hitting me here. Which is our smoothness. Which is category eight there. Yeah. The smoothness. I'm at about a four. Yeah. World do. Yeah. All right. I'm going to put this out now. Because it's not nuts. <laughs> Just being honest. It reflects. I bet it does. 53.5 so we do not recommend at all at all in any way shape or if form. you know what city or state omni music was in at this time please by all means let us know in the comments because now we've got to know yeah do you have a <coughs> what's the street 710 east durant do you have an East Durant or a Durant Street in your area? Let us know. Right. It could be from there. Right. And if, if anybody can tell us if they had this particular Omni Music, records, tapes, and paraphernalia on the 700 block of East Durant Street in your city, state, province, whatever the case may be. Country. Please. Let us know. Let us know in the comments. I'd like to know where the we comments were from. We would love to do a live stream and call these guys and find out as much as we can about them and when these came out. If they even exist anymore. That they could very well be gone in the modern day of music. But there is still a big vinyl market. Oh, there is. 
So but there's if, not a big market for if they water have... beds. <laughs> <laughs> that's the other thing. I want to know if that's meant to say water beds <laughs> or if it's meant to say <coughs> water bombs. <laughs> Because <laughs> there's still a good market for those. So. I just. Uh, hilarious, man. It They're is. Absolutely hilarious. Talk about mixed messages. Right. So, I do like the fun factor of these papers and the rare factor, but let's just be brutally honest. Is that factor enough to make up for its deficiency? No. No, no, no. no, no. However. No, no, no. That no. is enough of a factor for a live stream. If, if they there's still actually around. someone we can get a hold of from this company. Plus, I'd like to know why they chose rolling papers as a, an advertising source. It's I brilliant. Mean, I know. Uh, it's brilliant. I want to say that. Tobacco use was pretty heavy still in the 70s and 80s, so. Yeah, but I don't think this was for tobacco. I don't think it was either. Yeah. And I'd really like to find that out. But yeah, my guess know. is, is they saw how many copies of Pink Floyd albums went out the door and figured, trust me, this is going to work. It's a great advertising gimmick, but you didn't put much info on there. Yeah. So it's a epic fail. Epic fail. Yeah. Uh, live stream worthy. Yes. Yes, I think so. I think so. If, even if the place is gone, if we can get somebody who used to own it, somebody who used to work there. I was going to say an ex-employee. Anyone. A patron. Anyone. Somebody who... Omni Music from 710 East Durant Street. Wherever that is. We don't know where... Uh, I got a phone number that may help. Uh, 925-8768. Doesn't give us an area code. <laughs> we don't know where you're from? Yeah. Even an area code would have helped tremendously. Well, for sure. For sure. It's just... Yeah. No. Oh. Fail. Epic. Uh, Fail. Not a recommended, but still good humor. It is. And it's not like you're going to find many of those around, probably. No. But, no, uh, they were mostly used and thrown away. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they ended up in the file cabinet at the end of the desk. Yeah. Yeah. The round one. Yeah. When it gets empty every night. Yeah. But, yeah. On that note, guys, girls, people, animals, whatever wants to watch us, whatever wants to put up with us, because that's the biggest thing. So long, farewell, and we will say goodbye. We're going to add music behind that one of these days. Oh, God, terrifying. <laughs> All right, peeps. You probably had way more than enough of us, so. Yeah. Till next time. Adios, muchachos. We're out. <laughs>